Hey, check this out. New Alpha clothing collection. You already know what it is. We got the unboxing right here, right now. This looks like a hoodie. Yeah, it's like pristine packaging besides that. I'm pretty sure the company like to look at this. But, oh shit, oh, we got, oh, okay. We got the wash. Oh, that's new. AC one in the back. Hold up. Hold up. I like that. I like the color. You know what I'm saying? Then we got this joint in black. I think the same one. I'm not 100% sure. Yep. Same thing in black. The wash. What is it? What's it called? Was it just like one? Like wash? Wash something? Yeah, there's a lot of stuff in there. Oh word! So we run it with the we run it with the tracks with the windsuit. We want it with some okay. Oh look, okay. I like that the little hint right there. Okay, I see you. We run it with some with some track. We got same thing. Oh, oh, I thought this was the same thing, but they not. Okay, okay. We really out here right now. Yo, this is on some, they just, Alpha just took a a quick, a quick lap for a second. You know what I'm saying? Like, okay, this, these, these look more like, you know, every day, like you can wear these in the gym, but I mean, everything honestly go in the gym and outside the gym. But these is like, you know, possibly club acceptable. <laughs> hey, the collection is out. No more pre-orders, straight orders, straight orders. The don't touch tees, man. Oh, shit. The don't touch tees. Let me, let me, let me pop it. Let me. A smell test? So we got the don't touch tees. In black. Boom, look at that. Pristine. Pristine right there. Boom. We got these joints. In gray. Pristine. See that gray right there? Yeah. This is quality. This is, this is quality. I don't know what y'all thought this was, but this is quality right here. What is this, quarter sleeves? Right here? And these, these, this is the real drip right here. This is the real drip. Like, the, why you so low? I don't know, right? <laughs> See, everybody was kind of confused when I, when I mentioned, I'm like, yo, let's do something different. Let's do pink. Let's do pink sleeves with the gray mid, and then we're gonna do like pink with like the black mid, possibly. But this is fire. This is that Miami Vice color right here. Got that pink, got that blue Man, don't get too in there. Close, bro. Say what? what? Don't get too close. What you, what you mean? They, they gotta learn. They gotta learn what the drip is like up close. It'd be better up close there you go. if it was in your own home. Okay? Cause you, you, got, you, you was know, wearing it. Was wearing it. All right. It's and guess what? Mirror. Guess what? You know what? You know what? What's even better if you wear it and tag me in that joint? You might get a little couple followers here and there. Cause I repost them joints, you know what I'm saying. So you'll be on my page. I also, I also want to put together like a little video thing for like everybody wearing my stuff. So please do with the the hoodies. I already got the gray, right? So Jeff, this is yours. Oh, word. But oh, that shit looks that shit looks fresh. No, this it's fucked. Man, you look mad average, yo. Mad average, Man, right? Son. Fuck. But check this out, yo. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, you about to hit a PR? Oh, word? Oh. Oh, you benching it? Oh, bench Mondays? Oh, let's go. Let's fucking go, bro. <laughs> oh, this is what I've been waiting for, right? The texture. These is what I've been waiting on. Y'all don't understand. Look, y'all don't understand the rubber band man right oh. here. All right, y'all do not. Y'all love joggers like these. I'm like, that's the thing about when you in fitness and you like you work out and shit and you a dude, you can wear the same shit every day and people think it's different. Kind of, as long as it's black. If it's black and you wear it every day, I mean, unless, I mean, people know you got this, but you can wear a hoodie every day. You know, you can wear the same hoodie every day, can you not? Like, is that like, I want to head to the gym now. Let's go and get that new clothing. You just kind of want to show it off. You just kind of want to walk around. Like, oh, where'd you get? Oh, this, this, these are mine. This is that pristine shit right here. What you got on Nike? <laughs> just like everyone else. Oh, we got them hoes in olive too. And they shorts. Oh shit, squat day, let's go. Let's go with some running squat leg shorts. 
Bro, we're really out. Look at the drip. Look at this is the drip right here. You got to add right there the drip over alpha in the video. Oh, I ain't going to lie. We got a lot more left. Man, is it going to be a part two? Yo, two? fuck. We might have to like just, you know, the drip. <laughs> and black, man. Hold on. Let me do it. Let me do an outfit change real quick. Oh, oh, this is the outfit right here. All oh, these feel so good, y'all. Y'all understand. Y'all understand the drip right now. Bro, I'm, I'm, the drip. All right, check it. So we got olive again. Two olive, that's the same color. No, they're different. Oh, these are different, bet. Cause these got the pockets right here. And these don't, yeah, they're, they're different. Yeah, I can see the color difference and the texture difference as well. But y'all already know, man, use code Aftermath. 15, not 10, not 20, but right in between, just right. Just right, okay? The, the, the right porridge. The right porridge. 15% off code Aftermath. You guys already know. We got, boom. These are a little bit more cottony. Yo, these feel so good. That gray is nice. Oh, the brown. Got the brown drip. Got the brown drip. I personally ain't a brown colored person like that. But you know what? We gonna rock them anyways. Why? I like these, the little laces. The hot, they got that little reflector. The reflector on it. Oh, they got the reflector on everything, yeah. All the laces are reflector. Same thing with here. So we got the brown, we got the black. Boom. All my fitness stuff. I don't know what to call these. The Cybots, these are the Cybot 2020s right here. The Cybot 2020s, y'all. I like that, I like that shimmer. I need to find out what this is. Cause you got this. I guess it's the same thing right here. Yep, same, right here. Same, same, but different. Same, but different with the olive. I'm glad they didn't do military, y'all. I, I don't like camo. Like, I used to like the, with the gray and white and black camo. I right, had these pants, man. Oh, look at this. Gray and white camo, camo? That's yeah. some snow, that's some, that's, some yo. snow stuff. You yeah. got these right here, the Cisco's. I call these the Cisco's. Hey, I'm used to dragon. Right I'm used to dragon. You know what I'm saying? These is like, you know what I'm saying? You get that lady like, come. You just gotta put on something real quick. And like, you just throw it on the Cisco's. And you just walk in her house and you're like, baby. <laughs> 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 The last one, y'all. The oh, oh, Michael Jackson's glove has been made into some shorts, all right? Oh, word. Word. <laughs> right here. These are the, the Chamones right here. The Chim <laughs> these are the Chamones right here. Come on now. Come on now. Nah, damn, nah. These are the R. Kelly's on a beach, like yacht. R and B. Nah, nah. Nah, 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 nah. nah, nah. nah. You can wear these in the gym. You can wear these at, at, at the pool party. You can work. You can definitely wear these at the grill with the Jesus sandals, okay? With the toes out and, and everything. I'm stylizing y'all. Y'all gonna appreciate this. All right, let's get to some working out. Of course, my life matters to me, but not just mine. Everyone's. Don't fear failure. It's all as true today as when you were 12. Handle that business. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, B Aftermath. We back at the gym. We got shoulders this weekend. Today is Saturday, we wanna hit some shoulders. Um, quick thing to let you guys know, as you can see, the drip is on me right now. We got that Don't Touch merchandise. All right. What is this, the quarter sleeve? Quarter sleeve tees right here with the Don't Touch logo. Purely aesthetic, you know what I'm saying? Look at the nice quality on this joint. I'm looking clean as fuck, bro. This is that back day, this is that back day shoulder day shirt right here, okay? You wanna go in this joint looking clean? You need to cop this right now, all right? 15% off of Alpha Clothing, code Aftermath. Link in the description for all of the drip. Check this out, like I said, we're gonna hit shoulders today. And I kinda wanna go over some, some key points for doing overhead presses when it comes to 
joint discomfort and um, like just pains, nicks and pains, and what I've been doing to overcome that and uh, to avoid that. Um, and I know everybody does this. Everybody does this. And we kind of have taught ourselves to, to trade, do overhead pressing and things this way. So let me, we're gonna change that. And I hope this helps you out. So let me, um, let me find out what's going on with my headphones. First off, my power beats ain't working, but you know what? I got the studios and guess what? We got skins, I got burgers, I got hot dogs, I got french fries. I'm plugging right now, y'all. I got donuts. This is the, the cheat meal head covers, all right? Use code Aftermath at beatskicks.com. All right, let me stop, because I'm like, I know somebody's already in chat like, just get on with the workout, bro. Just get on with it. As I said, today we're going to be focusing on a more comfortable way, possibly hopefully for you, to overhead press. Now, when it comes to overhead press, we do a lot of benching, especially if you're like me, I bench a lot. So doing overhead press puts a lot of stress and forward, forward um, pull into those front delts, into the chest, which gives you that, that look like this. And we don't want that. We want to be able to be back here. And we also don't want a lot of pressure and tension in this area right here. We need this area to be opened up more, right? So that being said, when we overhead press, what do we tend to do? You see, we tend to do this. See how my elbows are already out right here? There's already a lot of unwanted tension in my elbows, but we've just been taught that to hit the front delt. So all this tension right here, just going into my elbows can be taken away by coming in a little closer, and instead of being out here, we push it in, just like you would with a bench, that close grip, bringing those elbows in, we push it in right here, and then going up, rather than being out here. So keep those elbows right here. We want them at angles, rather than being out here at 90s. We want it more, more in. I'm gonna do sets, probably about to eight. I wanna do three, three different types of movements when it comes to overhead press. We're gonna do here, we're gonna do barbell so I can show you the positioning of my hands when I do barbell overhead press, and we're gonna do dumbbell to finish off. So I can show you how to pretty much keep your, your arm placement when doing that as well. See, when it's in, I can sit my arms on my lats. I'm very stable right here, it feels good. Without weight, all that tension I feel in my elbows to my, my shoulder joint right here is much more comfortable, much more natural feeling. Instead of so right here, instead of out here, boom, bring it in, and I feel it a lot in my front delts.
gonna have trouble with that. Maybe set to 20 with the cable presses fast, explosive. Shoulder endurance, also core work as well. Oh shit, I'm gonna do five reps, which is one, two, three, four, five, which is 10 all together. One, two, three, four, five, seven, nine, 10. For three sets, I got an A. I think I might go a little heavier. This is the 15. Normally I would not end my workouts with this, but the racks were taken up, so I honestly had no choice. Ain't that strong yet right now. Say what? Look shit right there. Of course my life matters to me, but not just mine. Everyone's. Don't fear failure. It's all as true today as when you were